Happy New Year curl friends and in this curly girl chronicle I'm going to show you how I use this Simply Shea product line that I can you believe it picked up at my local Dollar Tree. Started with the um, deep moisture shampoo but I just wanted to let you all know that since I just colored my hair um, I do have conditioner in it right now from um, the conditioner that they put in with the color kit so um, I like to always condition my hair first with that conditioner um, whenever I color my hair so that it's not totally damaged by the um, shampoo because I am going to be using this deep moisture shampoo and I want to get a good good clean on my hair but as you can see I haven't lost any um, curl definition or anything from the color that I just put in and so I put this conditioner on <clears throat> goodness excuse me and I've let it sit on my hair for about, it's been about 30 minutes and it's, it's drying up right now. So at any rate, I'm going to go ahead and start off with this uh, deep moisture shampoo. So let's get into it. So right here I'm just going ahead and sectioning my hair into four sections and I'm going to wet my hair completely so that I can apply the product. So going in with the deep moisture shampoo, it claims to deliver silky, strong and beautifully clean hair. This moisturizing shampoo is designed to gently clean without damage. Organic Shea Butter deeply infuses and seals healthy moisture into hair, creating lasting strength and shine. So I saw some reviews online and people were saying that the shampoo did not lather but for me I didn't have that issue as you can see um, the small amount that I applied as soon as I applied it um, it did seem to lather rather quickly and being um, that I have natural hair I don't really look for um, a big lather or a lot of suds to me it felt like a conditioner so um, I was very pleased with um, the results as far as you know getting a lather and feeling creamy. I felt like it was moisturizing to my hair. So going in with the deep conditioner and co-wash, it claims to infuse the hair with the moisture that it needs. Organic Shea Butter deeply infuses and seals moisture into hair, strengthening and eliminating brittleness and frizz, but also adding a healthy shine. It is perfect to use as a co-wash between shampooing, gently cleaning the hair without stripping it of oils. So I actually took a really generous amount of the leave-in conditioner and um, applied it throughout my hair. Since I just applied the color, I wanted to make sure that I coated the hair generously with the leave-in conditioner. Um, 
so that um, everything could get moisturized you know after you color your hair sometimes it can be left a little bit dry so I just wanted to make sure that I again coated every strand So once I applied the um, leave-in conditioner generously, I went ahead and put on my plastic cap so that I could deep condition for about 20 minutes. The bottle says only 5, but since I colored, I wanted to do a little bit longer. So now that I've deep conditioned, I'm going in with the leave-in conditioner, which detangles, softens, adds manageability to all hair types. This light moisturizer can be used daily without buildup and creates a perfect pre-step protection to styling. Organic shea butter deeply infuses and seals healthy moisture into hair creating lasting strength and shine. And as you can see I'm doing just that. I'm applying the product generously through my hair and getting ready to um, add the next product. Now taking the curl stretch cream. This cream maximizes natural hair's natural curl pattern, creating frizz free and shiny curls. As the hair dries, it can shrink, kink, and frizz. This rich cream will maximize shrinkage, stretching, and elongating curls to ultimate bounciness. So now I'm finishing up with the Simply Shea Curl Defining Gel, which provides definition and control to natural curls. Its crunch-free formula eliminates frizz and maximizes shine. So I did decide to go ahead and diffuse my hair simply because I just couldn't wait five to eight hours for my hair to dry. So um, I felt like the product was not crunchy at all once I finished doing my um, diffuse method. And here's the final result. I feel like for a dollar, um, these products really did work great. And I did take some Eco Styler Gel just to hit my edges 
um, because the, the, the defining gel was so soft that I needed just a little bit more hold around the front of my hair. But again, I would highly recommend that you go and at least try the product. It doesn't work for everyone's hair, but it works wonderfully in mine. So I give this product a thumbs up, a A+. Thanks so much for watching, girlfriends, and I'll see you in my next Curly Girl product. Bye.